Hey y'all, it's Rhonda with the Cozy Loft and we are on vlog four. So far so good. I'm getting a vlog done each week of the new year so far. So my 2022 goals are already being slayed. This week in the studio, I work on some hearts for some gifts for some of my friends. These aren't the smaller hearts like I've been showing you. These are just some hearts that I had here and I thought it would be nice to just randomly create some little Valentine's gifts. So this was just the base coating of the hearts here.
I love shopping on eBay and I found some great deals there for the Blue Yeti microphones. There are so many additional assurances on eBay when you order there, even more so than some of the larger places you can order online. I've ordered an additional USB 4 port in it that should be here later today so I'll be able to use the microphone. Uh, so I'll start using it next week. I'm not using it yet so we'll see what it sounds like next week. And I'm going to include an eBay affiliate link below in the description and you can see the types of Blue Yeti microphones like what I ordered. Back to the studio now. I'm going to work on some more of those hearts from earlier. I had already did a few things for this obviously off camera, but this one's for a precious family member and I just wanted to make it super special for her. Uh, it made me wonder while I was working on these if I could probably sell them. Uh, I don't know, maybe something I look into in the future, but just let me know if you think that might be something that you would like to see me sell. Uh, in this clip, I'm just looking through my stash to see what I can find to embellish the heart and just kind of playing around with different ideas.
In 2021, Henderson County, where I live, had its bicentennial celebration. That's 200 years since my county was formed. That's probably something to really celebrate. Uh, Daryl Worley, who is the country music star, you may know of him, he actually lives in Hardin County, which is just down the road from us here in Henderson County. And he was invited to play at the celebration back on November the 6th. I'm going to include a little of that footage here. Never know. I hear people say, we don't need this war. I say there's some things worth fighting for. What about our freedom and this piece of ground? Didn't get to keep us right back in there. They say we don't realize the best way to get to hell. Before you start your preaching, let me ask you this, my friend. Have you forgot how it felt that day? See your homeland under fire And her people blown away Have you forgot When those towers fell We had neighbors still inside Going through a living hell And you say we shouldn't worry about them a lot Have you forgot Oh, and I sure grabbed my Daryl Worley tea too. I found myself wishing I had ordered one of our county t-shirts and I was excited to find I could still get them. I'm really happy they came in this month and they are super cute. My next studio task, I just thought I would include it just because it's something I did this week, was some footage of where I had some wood bead strings that I needed to cut apart. They're just not great to store when they're in strings like that. I'm sure there was probably an easier way than how I did it, but this got it done and it went pretty quick. Since my house was built in the 50s, there's still some updating that I need to do. One of those updates is the doors and windows. I was working at the computer one day and the wind was blowing really hard outside and I was getting really cold. I was sitting near my patio doors and I just looked over and the blinds were moving from the wind. Check out how much wind was getting through my doors. And there's no central heat on, no reason there should have been any movement. By the way, vertical blinds aren't the cutest, but when you have a cat, they are amazing. So I got online and I found out a good temporary fix is to roll up a thick towel and place it in the track. This helped tremendously. Though I do know I'm going to need to replace that door soon. I also wanted to share this week that my darts came in to use on my new dartboard. And you can order these steel tip darts in many places. I found them to be cheaper on eBay than at the local Walmart. Plus the eBay price includes shipping. And uh, it was crazy how that was cheaper, but I'm gonna include an affiliate link below for those. Check out my first throw with my new darts. Oh yeah, there we go. Thanks for coming by to share another week with me and I'll see y'all again very soon.